Hello, my friends, I'm Brett Larkin. This is a beginner-friendly Kundalini awakening meditation. Let's get on the mat. It's time to feel uplifted. So we always start every Kundalini yoga practice the same way, by tuning in. So this mantra, Om Namo Guru Dev Namo, it's called the Adi Mantra, and we're gonna chant it three times. So rub the palms together. You can always just listen at the beginning if you don't feel comfortable chanting. Lift the sternum to meet the thumbs. Have a good, nice three to five pounds of pressure, pressing the palms. And exhale all the air out of the body and inhaling to tune in. Om. Guru Dev Namo Om Namo Guru Guru Dev Namo. Inhale, take a deep breath in. Hold, suspend the breath at the top. Lift your gaze even with the eyes closed to so visualize your eyes moving up to the brow point. Lift your navel, your heart. Hold. Exhale when you need to, just take the palms face up on the thighs, index finger and thumb touch. Just notice the after effects of your tune in. This Adi Mantra connects us to what's called the golden chain. All the teachers, healers, ancestors, who care for us and guide us past, present, and future. And this tune-in is so important for a kundalini activating practice because it opens and creates a safe container for us to begin to move energy. We're going to come into an active breath of fire. So you can keep your eyes closed. If you're familiar with breath of fire, if not, I'm gonna invite you to just open your eyes and look at me on the screen so that we can go over this together. You'll just have, start with your hand on your belly and it's a sharp staccato exhale out the nose. The inhale is passive. So you can stick your tongue out like a dog. and then close the lips and really activate through uh, the nose, but the activation's really coming from the navel. This is a core workout. So you should feel the belly dance as you do this. You should really feel the force of the exhalation, your navel snapping back into the spine being what's pushing your exhale out. So let's take the arms straight still in this guy in mudra. So the arms are gonna be straight, chest lifted. So a lot of times we're here for today, we're gonna to really activate through the arms and close the eyes and begin your breath of fire. Find your rhythm so you can go very slow. If you're just getting the hang of this, can go a little faster, find your pace, what feels comfortable for you. To help focus your mind, you can think silently the mantra Sat Nam, Sat Truth Nam Identity, Sat Nam, Sat Nam, Sat Nam, Sat Nam. And your drishti, your focal point, your internal gaze is at that space between and above the eyebrows, the third eye center.
visualize a space that's just two inches below your navel, your belly button as the place that's really forcing this exhale out. Let's just do, do 10 more seconds together. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold the breath in the body. Lift the chest, lift the gaze, pull the navel back and in, relax the shoulders and the jaw. Maybe visualize light energy swirling, spiraling up the spine. When you need to exhale, you can bring a bend back into the elbows, soften the face and gaze. And just observe your internal state. Let any energy you activated begin to settle. Anytime you're doing a Kundalini activating practice, it's important to take time between each of the exercises to really allow the intelligence of the prana the life force, the energy that you're activating, time to settle, time to go where it needs to go. So we've done the yang. Now let's sink a little bit into the yin. Just let yourself simply be here observing your experience. Beautiful. Now we're going to practice breath of fire again, this time curling the fingers into the pads of the hands with the thumbs out and taking the arms to 45 degrees. This 45 degrees is important. So this would be straight up to the ceiling and this would be 90. We want to be right in between. This stimulates uh, lymph, lymphs and uh, hormones uh, around the area of the armpit. So close your eyes, exhale all the breath out. Inhale part way. Same thing, breath of fire. Slow it down or speed it up based on what you need. We're not going to be here very long. Sat nam, sat nam. Do an integrity check. Make sure it's really the navel that's pushing the exhale out. Just about 20 more seconds. Last five, four, three, two, one. Hold, suspend the breath in, bring the thumbs to touch above the head and extend the fingers, straighten the fingers straight up towards the ceiling. Fingers are touching, get strong like steel through the arms. Lift up the pelvic floor, the gaze, the heart. Hold, hold, hold. Exhale, let everything go when you need to. Come back to that Gyan Mudra, index finger and thumb touch. Deep breath in and out. From here, bring the hands to prayer at heart center. And just take some long, slow, deep breaths with the palms really firmly pressing into each other at the level of the heart. Balancing this energy we've lifted at the heart center. Long, slow, deep breathing in and out through the nose. Gaze can stay lifted at that third eye center. Wonderful job. From here, I'm going to invite you to lie down. So just lie down 
on your sticky mat or wherever you are in your house and just let this energy settle before you go on and move about your day. So just come to lie down and gift yourself a couple minutes of rest. This is a very intense activating practice. So you need this time on your back just to incorporate, rejuvenate, and renew. You can receive this satnam as I chant it to close the space. And I'm sending you so much love from my heart to yours. Namaste. Hey, if you liked this video, you will love my Uplifted Academy with courses on each of the chakras, as well as courses on Lakshmi, the Vedas, and how to do a 40-day Kriya, all which also count towards your continuing education requirement with Yoga Alliance. Click here to learn more about Uplifted Academy and how it can deepen and enrich your yoga practice. And if you're hanging out here on YouTube, here's the video I suggest watching next. So much love from my heart to yours. Namaste.